To become a great social entrepreneur, it is really important that from the very beginning you take a careful note of the potential challenges that you might be facing along the way towards your social entrepreneurial journey because you don't want to set your path towards fail. So in this part I'm going to tell you some of the challenges that a social entrepreneur might face. So the very first challenge that a social entrepreneur might face is its dual mission. Because social enterprises aspire to make a lasting social change by solving a social problem. But this mission is not deviant from the economic objective. That is, they also want to make money or earn some income from this venture so that they will be able to feed themselves at the same time sustain the venture. But when it comes to earning some revenue or some profit from your venture, people might misconceive or misunderstand your social enterprise venture. So it is very important that from the very beginning you declare the business model that yes, it's a social enterprise, but at the same time it's also a revenue generating business. And that way you will be able to eliminate the challenge of this dual mission. Another potential challenge that a social entrepreneur might face is lack of proper business strategy. See, most of the time, social entrepreneurs come with lots of passion to bring a lasting change in the society. But they may not have the business background or managerial skill. So it is really important for business to sustain, to have a proper strategic vision, financial forecasting, looking into the business model, and so on and so forth. So all of these elements are really essential. But the overemphasis towards social impact or social change might shadow all of these aspects of a business model creation or scaling up the venture. So having the proper business strategy is really important. So as a social entrepreneur, you need to understand from the very beginning what is your business model and what are the, your strategies that you will be able to enter into the competitive market. The third challenge associated with social enterprises is the ability to scale up the venture. You might start in your venture with immense amount of passion and enthusiasm. But over a year or two, it will be important that you're able to scale up the venture towards the next level. Now, the trouble is, still today there are many countries where there's not enough structured policies or financial institutions supporting social ventures. So this becomes a big problem that you're not able to scale up the venture. You need lots of support and backup to be able to take your venture to the next level or you wanna reach out to more communities and affect their lives through your social enterprise venture. But this could be a big problem. Funding of the social enterprise is another big challenge. We have discussed this in the funding section that uh, in many countries still today, there are not enough financial institutions or business incubators that are supporting social mission. Besides, you might start with your own savings at the beginning, but you may not be able to carry that on for a sustained period of time because you need to scale up the venture. You need to take the organization to the next level. You need to recruit more people. You need to reach out to more communities. And for that reason, you need the finance. So these are some of the challenges, and as a social entrepreneur, you should keep these challenges in mind. But these challenges should never demotivate you, or you should never step back. Because as a social change maker, every challenge, you will consider that as an opportunity. And in our case study section, we will be discussing some practical example where we will see how social entrepreneurs, they're able to transform the challenges into more opportunities.